the following is a women's war games match the rules of the match are as follows two teams will be contained in separate cages with one member of each team starting the match at regular intervals alternating members from each team will be released to enter the match the team with the advantage will be the first to have a member released into the match once all competitors have entered war games officially begins the match could be won by pinfall or submission exiting the cage will result in a forfeit now let the war Introducing first, from Alabama, Christian! War Games is what happens when all else fails. She knows that, her teammates know that, and their opponents sure as hell know that. Neither side will give an inch to the other. Both sides know to show no mercy. Yeah, but in the middle of this chaos, this battle will need leaders, and there's no better leader than the first soldier on the battlefield. She's gonna have to compete at her highest level even with the advantage. Such a talented competitor. I think we're about to see one of her best matches yet. She has gone from fabulous to untouchable. She calls herself the most beautiful woman in all of WWE. And from Staten Island, New York, the most beautiful woman in all of WWE, You need to be ready for anything at WWE, but nobody is really ever ready for war games. When this match got signed, she didn't know her team would face the numbers game. She also didn't know she'd be in first and would have to face two competitors on her own. Well, we have seen her successful in WWE thus far, but this, this is the ultimate test. It's not a fair situation, but we all know all is fair in love and war games. What do you know about love? A thing or two. First two to be locked inside as War Games ramps up. Yeah, Cole, remember, War Games doesn't officially begin until the last contestant enters the cage. We'll have to see if these two have the stamina to last until then. Standing Spanish fly, are you kidding me? Incredible. Oh, uh, there's the old oh, damage to the hamstrings. Running hip attack. What impact. Now oh, trampling the opposition. They're stomping away. And there was some force on that move. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. super kick. And she will climb the cage. Not the smartest of ideas. Was ready for that. Yeah. Snap suplex. Unbelievable athleticism. <laughs> Over the armbar. That was amazing. Well, this isn't going to win the left arm trap. Wiggles free. Nicely done. Uh, head scissors. Round and round we go. Truly spectacular. It's about to be an uphill battle. Team once this clock hits zero. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Got right the leg and drops the elbow. Corey, in a match like this, there are so many factors at play, so many moving pieces. How do you even game out a strategy here? 
Well, you have to look at it just like in a war, Cole. Sure, you can plan for every contingency, but all those plans just might have to go out the window once you're in the line of fire. The best you can really do is stay alert, use any and all numbers advantages to your benefit, and keep on swinging. Under the apron now, looking to stack the odds even higher in their team's favor here. Jumping neckbreaker, out. Ooh, she responds with a counter. Things could get ugly now as they head inside the cage. She got out of there. Yeah. Getting set up for something in the corner. That turns it around for Carmella. Oh, man, by the hair. Oh, man. Hair whip. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. Now she did palm strikes. Ooh, what a forearm club. Boot to a gut will stop anyone in their tracks. Here comes the buzzer. The numbers advantage vanishes with this next entrant. Door swings open and out they come. And their team could definitely use their help. She just went catapulting across that gap and into the other ring. Even in the teams and looking under the ring for a little extra insurance. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Strong forearm. A quick stop to pick up some artillery before she evens this one up. Using the elbow as a weapon. of the last 
competitor means that War Games is officially begun. It's hard to believe that what we just saw was the appetizer to the main course. These competitors are more than hungry. They're starving for war, starving for supremacy. This is War Games. since the bell, just looking for that window of opportunity. And now might be the time to seize the moment. Now is the time to keep the pressure on. More attacks up there could leave her severely impaired. Take, in my opinion, a well-deserved victory lap. 